Hello, welcome back to the Barrett Channel for a brand new video. Yeah, we are here in Shanghai at AW, which is Appliance and Electronics World Expo. Last year it was cancelled due to the pandemic, but this year, apart from having to show a health code, wear a mask, it's business as normal here in Shanghai. We're going to show you around some cool tech, so stick with us. Jing Dong here. So if anybody you don't know, Jing Dong are like if you if you look like Amazon in the if you look like Amazon in the, the UK or Europe, Jing Dong are like the equivalent of the Amazon. And they're pretty cool in, in a lot of the cities. They can even get you like same day delivery. Um, but they stock like a massive range of uh, of products, you know, pretty much anything. And uh, you just order it on your app online bam it's there either the same day or the following day in most circumstances but as far as e-commerce goes i think china are way ahead of most of the rest of the world and i think the reason for that is they they have wechat payments and alipay and that makes it so much easier to buy stuff literally you see something you choose it you scan your code, you do your fingerprint, bam, it's transaction done. You haven't got to worry about entering names and addresses and all sorts of numbers and stuff. It's just such a seamless process. It's so quick and so easy that you can just impulse buy everything. Well, that, that's right. It becomes, a, online here, becomes impulsive because you don't have to mess about to pay. Maybe you don't even want it, but you've already ordered it and it's there the following day, you know. So I've noticed Actually, I've noticed this is something that's big in China now. Lots of new complexes, they don't bother with keys. They all have these like digital locks and they're either like fingerprint or you can type a code in or both. And um, so it, you just like, you know, you put your thing here and you'll unlock the doors. Um, this is something that I've noticed is here more than back in the UK. It's like, everywhere now that they're building has these digital locks and, and not keys. I don't particularly know if the, the locks are all good though because you could have somebody else find out your password. Yeah, I mean, it is good to not have to worry about taking out keys yeah, yeah. half the time. So basically this is a, it's a waste bin that automatically puts the liner in. Then when it's full, you press a button, it seals the liner and you can just take it out. And as you can see, the whole thing is, is wrapped for you, and then you just take that down and, and put it in your... That's pretty good, because I've got a bit of a thing about getting my hands dirty, so I'd, I'd, I'd like that. Yeah, that's, that's really cool. Yeah. So up until today, I thought Conquer only made televisions, but it seems they have loads of stuff. Over there, they've got these like smart home appliances, but one of their newest things is they've got these refrigerators and this these are connected refrigerators so you've got this screen on them and you can do all sorts of things you can set timers so if you're cooking something at all you can set a timer you can watch videos you can listen to music but a couple of the really coolest features is this menu feature so you can you can look at various dishes that you might want to that you might want to cook and you can select one and it not only gives you all the ingredients, but it gives you all the steps, step by step, in, to actually make that dish. So I think that's a pretty cool thing. That's all right, yeah. Um, you can obviously then check that you've got all the stuff in your fridge to make it, but that's, that's pretty good. And the thing I like, I really like about it, you've got this like digital message board. So you can leave messages for your, your family. Like maybe if you've run out of cheese, you can put on here like buy cheese a lot of people write messages on their fridge don't they so i think that's a pretty cool idea i didn't realize it was like an up and down one i've not seen that before yeah i guess it's the fridge at the top and i would imagine this is probably yes yeah, so hey free, smart freezer at the bottom how, how did you work that out yeah. it looks pretty sleek actually whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, <laughs> filming filming <laughs> He's destroying the stand. <laughs> Oops. 
Oh, that's so cool. It's like the, um, the lion head that they use for the dancer, remember? They've done it out uh, of vegetables. vegetables. It's all out of like vegetables, like cauliflower, broccoli. That's really cool, man. I'm They've quite made, sure that. <laughs> made like a garden as well. Yeah, like. it's pretty cool, isn't it? It's kind of like a, what is this to reckon? That's real, man. Oh, that's that nice ham. Oh yeah, it's prosciutto, isn't it? That's nice, that is. So one thing that Conquer also have is smart products. And in here, it's a smart home demonstration. So one of the cool things that you can do with this is I can actually basically just tell her that I'm gonna leave by voice control and everything's gonna turn off and close automatically. Xiao Kang, Xiao Kang, what's all that? And there you go, everything's turned off. So right now, something really interesting behind me going on, you have a guy who's doing some traditional Suzhou embroidery and that's being displayed on a screen that is the latest technology, it's 8K micro LED and the cost of that screen is over a million dollars, it's actually 1.2 million US dollars and you can obviously see the clarity of how it's showing that embroidery. Right now we're going to ask the guy who's doing the embroidery a couple of questions. So you look quite young but how long have you been doing this for? Uh, I've been doing it for 10 years. 10 years. Yeah. Wow. Can I ask you how you think science and technology has affected the inheritance of this craft? Uh, I think science and technology is affected the the so earlier we showed you the massive micro LED technology. Now that technology is like super expensive. That big 236 inch screen is over a million dollars. Here we have a sort of smaller one and this is uses mini LED, but this is also very new technology. It's not even in the market yet, but you can see the quality of the picture. And then finally we have what is really now at the consumer level. This is an 88 inch OLED screen and OLED's very very good because the blacks are very black and the brights are very bright so the contrast on OLED is very very high. So what we have here is a, a TV that has a screen that you can see right through. As you can see if I put my hand behind it you can actually see my hand I think that is like really cool because when you're not watching TV, you can have it so it's like an interactive picture. Like right now they've got butterflies on it and you could have like, you could have it as a fish tank. So they've got these plants behind it. You imagine if you put fish on there and the fish was swimming around in like an aquarium. I do think that's pretty cool. Obviously this is sort of latest technology, but that's really good. So we've walked around and had a look around the Conquer stand and uh, we have Wendy here from Conquer. Nice like to say you, hello. Yeah. Yeah. Say hello. And uh, Wendy's going to answer a few questions I've got to ask. Of course. So the first question mm. is, I know Conquer are a really big brand in China. Yeah, you are right. I'm quite surprised actually that you have more than just televisions. I thought it was just TVs. But I'd like to ask, what, what other countries do you export to? More than 110 countries. So you have a distribution pretty much worldwide. Yeah, that's right. And we, we see you have some smart home products. Can you tell me how they make life easier for people, the smart home products? Uh, yes, if users are not, is not at home, we also can control all the uh, appliances uh, uh, through software. Oh, so you have an app on your phone yeah. and you can do things like turn on the cooker, yes. maybe turn on a different wash, devices wash, all from your phone, like, washing machine or yeah. cleaner and things. Oh, okay, yes. that's, that's... Also, you also can control by our TV. Or the TV, TV. Yeah. okay, so from the TV or from an app on your phone. Yes, you are okay, right. Okay, that's pretty yeah. cool. When we were looking around, we saw this massive screen, right? And it's yeah. 8K micro LED. Can yes. you tell me a bit more about that? I think it is really impressive. It's our main product this year. 
actually in 2019 we already launched all the products. Yeah, I mean, uh, I was really impressed that when they were doing that demonstration with the meat, yeah. the quality of the picture was just just like real life almost. It's really yeah. technology it's design. Really, yeah. yeah. Well, thank you very much for uh, answering my yes. questions today, Wendy. I really appreciate that. Thank and, you so uh, much. Thank you. So that was a good look around the conquer stand here and a few other bits and pieces here at AWE. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure to smash that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you're not already. And we will see you in the next one for now. Take, Take care. care.